Hello and welcome to this latest episode of TDO. In this episode, we're going to look at this DS Lite. It's my nephew's. It no longer works. Why? Because he put a 50 pence piece in this slot here, where the cartridge goes. It no longer works. So let's see if we can fix it for him. Poor DS Lite. You're not very well, are you? We plug you in. You flash your light. But that's all. Let's make you better again. First, take out the cartridge cover and the stylus. Then take a small crosshead screwdriver and remove the battery cover. Followed by the battery. Then remove the two crosshead screws underneath. Next, take a small tri-wing screwdriver and remove the three screws from the back. Nintendo don't want you in there, but a pound well spent on eBay will gain you entry. Using something pointed, remove the two rubber feet to reveal two more crosshead screws that need removing too. But don't forget that last tri-wing screw. Nintendo definitely don't want you in there. Carefully prise around the outside, then lift away the back case. The fuse is very small, so let's pop it under the microscope. Much better. Fuse F2 is right next to the cartridge slot and the battery connector. Before we check it with the multimeter, let's scrape off that residue. Test your continuity meter and then touch either side of the fuse. Nothing, so it's dead and needs replacing. I'll add some more solder, it will hopefully make it easier to wick away the old. Some flux will make the solder flow easier. In with the desoldering braid to remove the solder. This fuse has overstayed its welcome. Clean off the pads and let's fit a new one. 10 fast acting 0.5 amp SMD fuses can be purchased for around £3. Add a small amount of flux. And then thin the pads. Drop the new fuse into place. Roughly align it. It doesn't have to be perfect at this point. Touch one end of the fuse with the soldering iron and the solder surface tension will pull the fuse into position. 
A brief touch to the other end will finish the job. Before we reassemble the case, let's test again with the multimeter. First the fuse, then to the battery connector. Time to reassemble. Follow me. Move along. Move along.